You ready? Mm-hmm. Let's do this. Hi, I'm Nathan Ray and this is Edward Green. Hello there. One of the Green brothers from uh, Whitcomb Farm. Thanks for joining me to do this. Thanks very much for coming down and recording. Yeah, so this is the first time we're doing uh, coverage on Neutrino Disc Golf. Our first time doing this. Everyone's yeah. first time, so yeah. let's uh, let's see how it goes. So We're hey. all fresh-faced little babies in this kind of... Ex- Extravaganza? Extravaganza. Know. Extravaganza? Experiment, I think Experiment that's... Experiment is probably the better word. Yeah, so uh, how's it been this weekend so far? You know, I think it's all gone well. I think everyone had a good time, which mm-hmm. is the most important thing. Yeah. And and the weather held off just in time to just completely ruin us after the event finished, which was perfect as well. Um, so, yeah, ex- excellent times, really. Cool. And we had uh, quite a good... Uh, Final. We had some tight, uh, tight races in some of the in some of the divisions. Not so much in a couple of the others. No, so. no, but all worthy winners. Um, and some of them expected, some of them not. But yeah, no, it was great to see everyone. You know how they managed the course really, because a lot of people not been here before, and it is a different challenge. You know? Yeah, I went out with a few guys on on Friday on the practice round. Video also on this channel, and they'd never they'd never played the uh, Gulagong course either. So um, yeah. that was a good yeah. one. Yeah, we'll see elevation and such like that. You know? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well. Let's get into this uh, commentary. In the in the final, uh, we've got Joe O'Brien. Uh, he's on minus seventeen starting this round. Yeah, he was a heavy favourite, so it's kind of you know you'd be almost expecting it, but you know you never know what happens. But yeah, yeah, and, uh, young kid as well, Ben Holding. Yeah, not he's a young guy, isn't he? Stunning young player, and then uh, Connor, ultimate convert, but very tidy. And, yeah, yeah. Uh, of course, James Luton. James Luton. He's Legend. played here probably almost. More than any guy on course, apart from me, Pat and Angus, really. Yeah, so, yeah. again, expected to do well here. Yeah. Good player. So, uh, let's take a look at the, um, at the hole one. Well, that's well, it's Joe teeing off standardly, of course. So what's this, about 70 metres to the basket? Yeah, it's about 70 metres. Um, and I think, you know, you can have a pretty good run at it, really, you know. I mean... Uh, especially you play the open card. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go. Which Joe has not. I mean, it's a very safe play. I mean, you can't really go wrong there. Um, and with the lead that he's got, yeah, you know, he doesn't need to go yeah. for it, does he? Yeah. No. That's the way to do it. See, some people just have to skip right into the water, go across the pond. Yeah, forever. somebody was doing that on purpose yeah. earlier. No, I think Ben March did it and, and just nailed it. I mean, just. Big spike holes from holding here. Oh, little roll there, which you're going to expect on a lot of the holes around here. But yeah, that's an easy that was a tiny roll, really, in yeah. comparison. Connor, interesting hat. It makes me happy. It's, yeah, again, a good distance. Not getting the right kind of distance on it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, James got. What's he got? Get up, Thomas. Stay up. Get up, James. Uh, talking about I mean, skip. Wow. I mean, <laughs> drop zone's compulsory now, so I mean, yeah, whatever yeah. happens, even if it's hit the bank, there's no, oh, it touched and dropped. Is that a new rule then? Yeah. To that well, we used to have them as optional, uh, but we haven't run a tour event or a, a you know, rated event here for a while. Yeah. Apart from James, get there. Oh, no. So, wow. Oh, that was good. <laughs> I mean... That's how you want to react. We just just take it on the chin. Don't yeah, yeah. explode. So he, does he go back to the drop zone from there, no. or is it on the? Well, I think on he touched the bank. Though, yeah, he did. did he? Yeah, yeah. I mean, or, or that we from where he crossed. Yeah, I think that's what we did. I saw a third card in the open. All driver be on this today. All of them. All of them. Four in a row. I fell on the floor. Last so time. what's this put? Is he? Has he got the? Yeah, that's oh, a there good cut go. there. You know, because. If you do miss that, it's going to fade down the slope a bit or, or go into the water, you know. So it's very easy to just, just not get enough on this putt because mm. you've got the things around you. She so just gives you the willies, man. Well, there you go, there's, there's James. James, lovely. He gets his graceful, knees, uh, graceful. His graceful guy. <laughs> <laughs> Holding's got to get this. I mean, he's, he's solid. One, um, what the, yeah, there That's it is. it. Just, just one at Ben and Gary in the Nationals, um, and I, I, I've had a, I had at least one round with him there, and he was really just never looked, never looked beatable. Really, he was so good. Does like to do some 
absolutely crazy shots sometimes, but well, which I wouldn't be surprised to see him do here. But okay, he'd probably try so to go over the top. Right? Hole two. How how far is this one? Do you know? It's like a long 60 way. Sixty or something. Sixty. Uh, look at this. I mean, there's there's a few ways to play. You can try and go over the top like an absolute monster, which holding look is. Look at that. He is. And. Just he has, on and he does. This side of wow. the stream. That's incredible. That's but probably pin the high, best level, drive I've ever seen on that. Up near the up near the basket. But I've only ever seen one guy make the drive, make the green. I've never seen the eagle. So this is a nice play with point of that. I mean, yeah, it's the safe play is always there on this hole. I mean, there's a big space on the field. There's a lot of OBs around, but you got to back yourself to. What's he got? I don't think he'll go super aggressive here. He'll probably just try and get it into the bottom of the field. Yeah. Yeah. Just, yeah, just stay in bounds. Don't risk the OB. He's got it in him to go over the top. Yeah. He doesn't need to right now. Now, James may well try that because it seems like he's had not the greatest day at this point. And why not? He's got a chase, he's got to go. <laughs> I don't think that's gone well. I don't think it's come well. That either. laughing noise I heard. Yes. You can but, see the leaves yeah. just falling off the uh, off the branches Jimmy. there, just right. It's clipped it as it goes. Oh, Jimmy. <laughs> well, well, well into the uh, into uh, the trees. Here you go. Yeah. He does yeah, have he does have a little there, um, I mean, does have a little hole out, but it's just a pick. I mean, the four's still going to be there for him, but you really want to be three in this hole. Yeah. Um, it's it's and that's a. Uh, that's Charlie there, who was uh, following us around today. Or Joe, like Charlie Brown? <laughs> yeah. Or Charlie Mead? Charlie Mead. No, I shouldn't mean. See, there we go. I They'll mean, see it. You can just pop in that first field, yeah, get to yeah. that green. That's yeah, it. I mean... Yeah, it's nice. Just looking to recover this, surely. Here we go. Just like, just get near the basket, James. Don't... Well, I mean, that's still a question. He's a, he's a very good putter, but... Again, he just looks a little off there. Um, yeah, so Conor got long right up on the top of the, uh, of, on the path there, on the, on top, so it's a long way down from there. That's a long shot. Right. Oh, here we go. Come on, Ben. Do it, boy. Do it. Oh, oh that's oh. eagle. I mean, I, I think that's the first eagle I've ever seen on this hole, like, especially since we moved the basket to over the stream. Yeah. yeah that's, that's amazing. That is incredible. Sure. Look how far he has to go around just to get... Yeah. What just to get well, there. Quality, that boy. The tree will probably be here. I saw a bit of that from Connor this weekend. He's such a good player. But, I mean, I saw enough of it from myself as well, so... There we go. Come on, Jimmy. Come on. Save that bar. Yes, a yeah, nice yeah. touch set. Well done, mate. So, I, um, that's some easy tap into these guys. Joe, I mean, that's some birdie for him, right? Yeah, so it's a uh, birdie for Joe, eagle for Ben, eagle for ben. pass for the other guys. So, uh, Ben is now three down for two. Well, I mean, that's a good start. I mean, you yeah. can't offer much more. I mean, you're going into it. I mean, that's how you want to catch up, really. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, okay, so this hole. They're throwing from the the um. It's like an inbounds pen in this field. Yeah. I mean, you just got to get over this gap. Get over I mean, the top. There we go. He just made that. I mean, clip those branches, cutting it fine. You want to cut it reasonably fine, but yeah. that was yeah, it was a bit needlessly close. To the, this you, one's you can go a bit wider. You yeah, got the yeah. space to it. Especially. Yeah. You just but here it's about getting up as high as possible up yeah. that um because it's a par four. So I mean, it's, I saw Angus eagled this one just the other day. You know, yeah. a, and he's a righty with the big drive, big smash up the through, yeah. and then through the gap. But I mean, yeah, this one's called horror. It's not playing like that anymore. It's Isn't more that? like kitten. Kitten is quite easy. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I five touched a bit, but uh, let's, let's, let's talk about that the better. No, I got four here on Friday. Yeah, yeah. 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 Oh, here we go. You see. And that corner, you know, he's got a nice easy just poke over the top of that bush. Yeah. Uh, basket's just behind that bush, I mean. Yeah. I mean, the guy on the catch cam there wasn't in the right place. It was me. 
Yeah, that's a great shot by James. Though. That okay. is big. That looks like a nice. That's one. where you, you want to be. That's up right there. there. Up Immediately there. out the hand, you're like, yeah, that's the one. That's height. You know, it's the right line. And you got a lovely shot just up to that basket. You can see it framed through the bush here. So, yeah. it's you get that question on this hole. Easy shot around the outside or glory go, down the middle. Yeah, go through this. And there is there is some glory down the middle from Joe right there. I mean, yeah. It's nice to have that little window at the front yeah. there. Yeah, um, and you feel like an absolute G when you get it. It's like, bang, through that gap. Yeah, that's the hardest shot. It's the nicest shot. It's the prettier shot. There's a time in the place there. Nice to get up. Yeah. yeah. So yes. what we're not seeing today is the Champs 22 course that you put in mm. is Goolagon, but you put in five other holes, um, I think, was it? Well, yeah, well, yeah, so we put in a little 13-holer yeah. um, that's been good to run for our tournaments because they can take a long time and the course is hard to go, so again, a slightly shorter round, but yeah. for Champs, they wanted the double 18. Yeah. yeah. Easy pickings for them there. James. Wow, dude, dude, uh, he's better than this man, he's so good, wow, that's a shame, yeah, well, yeah. but yeah, no, it was nice to have the 218s for champs, and the space we had on the course was great, the like, yeah, lack yeah. of queuing, just, it was just yeah, I saw nice one flow. back up over the whole yeah, weekend, which, um, yeah, some That's people great. may have had a long walk to start, but I think your overall enjoyment, having that space between the holes, makes it worth it, really. That's, that's, I mean, it is a gimme, but have we seen him miss that last part? I mean, <laughs> yeah. come on, James, come on. Come on, let's go, let's go. There you go. That's there it. you go, boy. <laughs> I, think was, I was a little nervous there. <laughs> uh, there you go. Another birdie for Ben. Yeah. Birdie for Joe yeah, as well. Joe though. One too. Yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah. You're almost disappointed. Like when you're in that top card, if you're not birdieing that hole, it feels it doesn't feel great. Um, right. So this hole, you can't see the basket um, from the from the tee, and if you go long, I mean, how big is that drop oh, oh, behind that? It's, it's a weird one because I mean, we always we used to have the basket on this within that. Oh yeah, yeah. Stuff. So it was like and two meters up. Yeah. Off the, um, yeah. So then it was almost like, well, you just want to land just short of it. Whereas now with on that slope, maybe go long is the play just a little bit because then you always got that safe run back. Yeah. But it's brand new. I don't. I haven't, I haven't mastered this one yet. We put it in for this tournament. Yeah. I mean, so, but yeah, the drop off is huge. I mean, yeah, behind that basket, you go, and if you get on your edge, it's bye bye time. Um, it's um, I don't know if I want to put it back in the stump. Really, it was. It's, it got it's, a bit crazy. Man. It's crazy. Yeah. Me and Lee, um, who was on FBO this mm. this weekend, we played doubles here in 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 August. You played with Lee. Oh, she's wicked. Yeah, it's so good playing. It was so fun playing with it the whole the whole weekend. That could be nice from corner there. There you go. There see, you that's go. What you want, man. That's the drive. Yeah. yeah. So it's normally yeah, just in that stump to the left yeah. of the basket you see there, but. I don't know, certainly for champs, we were like, we can't be having people's tournaments yeah. to find going, that. getting yeah. eight. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I mean, that's what we did. We, I yeah. think it was a six or yeah. a seven. Yeah. It was, um, it was crazy. It's just, yeah, um, yeah. It's not a crazy golf course, is it? Um, again, James, that looks nice. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you go. That's it. Yeah, that's what we need to see. Mm. Although this does look a tad easy. Many things to do. Always adapting. <laughs> But yeah, I yeah. Know. So Ben was right down behind that tree. He did. He could see the basket from there, but um, it was it's a tricky part on the yeah. tree. I mean, you do well to get this, but yeah, you're going past it. Jesus. Was he laying up or was he going for it? <sighs> Safer on maybe. I don't know. Uh, I think there was enough venom in that that we could we give him the benefit. Okay, of that's fine. Yeah, we'll, okay. we'll give you that then. Um, now, Joe, we'll probably let this up. Yeah, yeah, talking about I a mean, safe run. <laughs> add to that as safe as you want. You wouldn't want much safer. No. <laughs> uh, because, yeah, that I mean, yeah, I mean, Joe ain't missing that, but still. Yeah. When you're going for the layup, you want it to be from the left end, really. I mean, yeah, so the drop this, this uh, post on the, uh, this 
this tree stump on the on the left there. That's where yeah. the that's where the yeah. the basket was sticking quite high up out of oh, that. So yeah. Yeah. yeah, I mean, yeah, just there behind Ben holding there. Yeah, I mean, but right out of the top of it, it was huge. Um, it was. We've been called evil people. Yeah. Easy par. Yeah, so two pars, uh, two birdies on that one. Right, so this hole is way up there on that, I don't know, on the side of that hill. Yeah. <laughs> on that little, there's a slight, slightly more level bit up there. So, uh, so he's in Texas. I like this route. I'm, I'm encouraging, well, I'm trying not to encourage people I'm playing against play it because it's too good. But that sneaky back route, I like yeah. it too. This is a normal route. James was thrown the kind of classic way, but especially for a right hand backhand player, yeah? Yeah. Smash one across the field, and it's a simple spike hyzer over to the basket. Mm. Like, I just think you're doing too much effort going up the straight way. So we've got two lefties, two righties on, on this guy. Yeah, I mean. <sighs> You'd hope to say it wouldn't make much of a difference because, yeah. like, they'd all have a good forehand. Yeah. Um, but Connor's I suppose forehand. one of the things about Joe is actually Joe, whilst his forehand's getting so better, he's, he's he's such an incredible player without having the best forehand. I mean, he's, he's he's like yeah. uh, he's got a brilliant turnover turnover shots, um, and so he doesn't really need it. But um, almost got our camera guy. Yeah. I mean, look at that. There you go. Are, there you go. Both of these guys. Who needs a forehand when you know? I mean, you can put and throw like him, but. Um, that will bend this a long way around the corner here. It's yeah. quite far around. He's probably got his fuse out. Yeah, just stay down. Yeah, that's yeah, nice that's to do it. Yeah, no, it's alright, buddy. Yeah, because there's a gap here over well, where gap, Connor but is. Even, yeah, I mean, you can, it's right over the top there. I'm surprised I don't see more people take it. It's a long way up. I saw, was it Ben March Bowdy doing that today? And it's just, yeah, I don't know. Um, even I've thought about it. Should be a simple enough layout here for Joe. I mean, doesn't even need to push him too hard. Again, yeah. I mean, he's just playing a smart final here, isn't yeah, he? Yeah, yeah. I mean, like, and that's that's what you want to do. Like, uh, you just, if you don't need to be a hero, just, just take a step back and watch other people around you. And... So Ben was talking about his um, his hockey. A career that he's having at school as well, so he's I talking mean, about not quite getting into the England team for for hockey for his uh, really yeah for his for his age group you know whatever it is so Ooh. Is quite a talented young lad I mean I saw yeah, the yeah. massive uh, gash on his arm I got a bit worried he'd done something on the course I was like oh god have we tripled Benjamin no thank God no just a hockey injury yeah, that's it nice James that's, nice that's what we need yeah. Yeah, they are great. Dead, dead sir, oh, out. Oh, is that the right, James? I see. Talking bad about my baskets. Didn't know I'd be listening to this, did you? Ooh. Again, from the corner there. And that's the thing. Just every so often, he's, he's such a good player. And I just... Mm. Oh, that's a shame. Maybe he's, this one. maybe he's happy at his isn't. Isn't well, oh, there we go. There it is. That's your, that's your bogey. <sighs> yeah. I mean, there's not many holes that you want to be bogeying, really. When you're up at this top level. And, and this certainly isn't one of them. There we go. Solid, solid final from Ben so far. I mean, he's doing all he can. Still, got a few holes left. Yeah. Yeah. You never know what can happen. This one's to another stump basket. So yeah, um, yeah. Oh, this is happen. a long way down. Yeah, it's such a beautiful drive. This one. Yeah. I mean, I'm pretty much a lefty backhand player. And I just love just throwing into that space to this, to this stump. That, but yeah. I mean, just. So oh, on. No. Oh, oh. Look at that. And it hit, some, hit, some, yeah. hit some branches You know there, what? I think. I think I left those branches out. I think I chopped them from before that stump and dumped them Oh, there. just dumped them on the side. Yeah, well, I took them far enough away from the green. I'm yeah, like, yeah, not yeah. Not make a green stop, but if someone does stop on them, I'm going to have to thank me for that. On Look at that from Ben. Flatten and go. Flatten. Go, go, go. That could be very nice. Oh, too oh, just, far. I think it just hit those, hit those yeah, branches. it's just got too much beans. 
That's all right. Yeah. You know, I mean, okay. he'll have a shot up to the basket from there, but well. So on Friday, on our practice round, um, I think Connor bounced the disc off the top of the uh, stump next to the uh, next to the basket. I did that myself once. I even pulled it. Your there we are. From Joe. This isn't roll too far. Yeah. Oh, but I'm interested to see if he takes that pad on because, like, you can just drop it by that stump, nice and easy. He yeah, doesn't need yeah. it, and if you miss it, that's right down the hill. I, I think he lays that up. Yeah. And and I would not blame him. Um, so I once saw a guy who could have dropped a putt on the last hole under the Gulagong basket. Great shot from Connor. There we go. Beautiful. Just, right. Little roll down the hill. Little bit more to roll down the hill. Yeah, Sit down so it's not too not too bad there. I mean, we haven't seen too many rolls really. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's, it can be a lot worse around here. But yeah, man, young lad literally could have dropped it under Google Gong basket and put it in. Instead, he missed the basket, threw it into the lake, yeah. scored his card wrong. I had to retrospectively give him like a two-shot penalty. Weird, man. Yeah, so um, Ben's uh, was caught by one of the branches up at the top end, but like the front branch, so all these branches were behind it. Right, right. So there was a bit of discussion about if he could clear them, if it was on his li uh, ah, okay. moving his line and things like that. I mean, there's enough um, experienced people around there. I'd, yeah. I'd, I'd guess they'd know, uh, know the rules. Yeah, um, but his his that you see the, the disc could, there is actually kind of underneath one of the branches, so they you like, know they weren't wanting to move yeah, that yeah, one. Yeah, 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 yeah. Want to do the stuff, but yeah. So. I mean, I think in these scenarios, common sense and a group discussion yeah. is the best way to deal with it. We well, obviously follow the rules, but like, you know, there there can be so space that, for common sense, you know, because it's a uh, it's a long way back up to that basket. Oh, oh and that is not a good shot. And there is a tree there. Yeah, a tree there, mate. I mean, James, he may as well, may as well, I mean, what's to lose at this point? Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Do it. Yeah, I mean, he's run that, proper run that. Um, Not quite enough? Not enough. This stunt basket's better, I mean, a bit more manageable. Than it's the not that it's, sheer it's, drop behind yeah, it, that's the um, thing. And it's just such a pretty shot as well. The thing is, filming on this course, it's it's hard to get a not pretty shot yes. with the, uh, yes. especially up on the hills with the, uh, you know, with the hills. It was starting raining at this point, you know, when we we're filming, yeah. so and when we we're playing, so. Oh, what a part there! There you go. go. And there's a shame actually, because the weather for the whole morning round was it's perfect. stunning. It yeah, was yeah, blue yeah. skies. I was just walking around, just being driven, going, "Oh my god, guys, we are so blessed today. This is in <laughs> such good condition." Cause, you know, when you're running this kind of... Oh, I mean, no. that's a brave shot from Connor there. Yeah, yeah, that's um, a tough one there. But... Oh, well. He's... You get the comeback, man. But, yeah, when you're running this kind of thing, you just you just know the weather means so much, like, to people's enjoyment, and you're just checking and checking. Yesterday praying, afternoon, praying. it was windy. Especially out on those new five holes, you know, now, it's the quite... Wind, I like. The wind is fine, because it just mixes up the game a bit, but... Any sort of moisture, yeah, nice that's it. part. That's how you do right it. Right into that stuff, that's a beauty. But yeah, it's just yeah, the moisture, the drying of the disc seat, just just miserable. There you go, nice little tapping for Joe there. Easy goes it. But at this point, I mean, he'd really surely have to make some pretty catastrophic mistakes. I mean, what have they got? Three to play. Three to play. Yeah. Three to play. I mean, they're all birdieable. I mean, eagle shot. In fact, I mean, I've seen the first one aced, I've seen the second one eagled, and yeah. what, someone changed, oh, Michael Sharp? Michael he Sharp. out the yeah. ace on Gulagong, uh, did it? Okay, let, um, we'll show his ace at the end, uh, his almost ace at the, at the end. That needs to just go a little bit, that needs to go, man, that's, that's just so short, James. Like, oh, wow. Circle. I mean, I did something similar in the wind today, actually. It was so windy there, you just, you didn't back throwing your normal putter shot. Oh, to just scoop under it. Well, I just felt it flipping, and it's OB on the left, OB long, and I just, the headwind just got in my head, and looks yeah, like it did yeah. to James, and not so much, Ben, who's really nailed it. But I did very similar shots to James, found it almost the same spot, and yeah. just, you know, literally just sim simple, yeah, just eyes or something. He probably threw a zone, I threw a half, just, yeah, and just shorted it. Terrible. So, is this the shortest hole on the? I would say it's the shortest, shortest hole on the one whole, of, whole one course. One of the easiest as um, well. 
I mean, I did get my massive punch on this, and that's different. But yeah, I mean, I could, it's that thing is, what happens is you go around this course, yeah. just throwing massive shot after massive shot, and, and then right, you get like, to this hole, right. and you're like, I have to throw a putter, but as softly as I can, almost like, and you're just not used yeah, to that yeah. little. Uh, and the amount of times I do that, long. it's you right, do, it's right there. Yeah, I just yeah, yeah. do the Connor right there, and I, I, I've almost gone OB. You know, you should, you have to, I've just learned to just get a whiz and just go meh. <laughs> What's he got? Come on. I don't know. I don't know. Come on. Tongue out of the mouth. Surely get in. Oh. Right the amount of times those little poles save people as well. Yeah. Do they? Oh, so, right, yeah. that, that's quite a tall little there's stick a, right uh, there. And you just hit him and go, bing! There's uh, a sheep skull on one of them, isn't there? A lot, yeah, is there? <laughs> <laughs> that's that's or, um, Sam Stevens got quite annoyed once because he threw in this approach and it clipped one of the sheep styles and broke off and embedded in his disc. Oh, He's like, man. man, I love this AVR. I'm like, and yeah, been no, chomped it's got by a part of the farm with it, man. You should be happy. It's like lucky. What do you reckon, Joe? I reckon, yes. Come on. If he goes for it, surely he gets it. And he's going for this one. Oh, oh I jinxed you, Joe. Sorry, so is that the <laughs> is that the, the legendary baskets here, you know? Um, they are legendary. I mean, um, <laughs> That was just uh, rookie side, clearly. I didn't see... I don't really think I saw barely any this weekend that definitely should have stuck that didn't go in. Um, I saw James had a pretty tough one on our first hole of the tournament, but it wasn't perfect. No. Um, and they've, they've held up surprisingly well, considering how long ago they were made and such. Right, this one is crazy long. I love this hole. All the way along the top of the hill. So, um, Ben threw it here. And it went down. A bit, bit and it right went down. Side there. It yeah. went over the t it, over the basket of the hole down there, and then further into the woods, and probably into the stream at the bottom of the hill. I'm gonna call that OB. I'm afraid. Yeah, it was, went over two fences. You get to have two OBs for crossing into one OB field, and then another, and then into a stream. Into a stream, yeah. It was. Um, we'll see in a minute where he where he's playing. Uh, have to flip that one to get that to go. Yeah, it's gonna have to turn. There we go. It's getting there that we turn. Go. Come comes, on, baby. It's coming round. It's coming round. I mean, this hole, you can drive massively far, or you can just drive into that next field. Yeah, but yeah. as long as you get through, I think you got a shot to the basket because there's so much space. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, I. Uh, this was the only hole I birded on Friday when I was when I was playing Hooligan course. So. I, I saw the most bonkers thing on this hole. That was pretty nice from Joe. There you go. Yeah, there we go. Nice Straight over the say. cameraman's head. And so the basket is just just down at the bottom of the hill there. Alright. Come on, James. Let's yeah, see what you big got. Big smash. Big smash. Keep this one quite low, really, I think. And then I see that there. Sure. So. Go just a bit. Mm. Yeah, I yeah. That's okay. I just think, you know, you, you got it there as that, as that righty to, to get one turning so, into that I'm just going to pause this here. Yeah. I'm going to pause this here. Yeah. Ben's disc went down across that next field and into the trees the other side. I don't know what the name of the basket is there. It's um, the Nomad's it's one. Nomad's one, yeah. yeah. So it went down onto Nomad's fairway and, and, and was lost somewhere I down mean, there. Yeah, I mean, that's just... I mean, the thing is... You can just get it on this farm because there's so much space. You yeah. get one with momentum turning into a gap and it's gone. With it's a bit of a breeze like, as well, yeah. Um, yeah, there are holes I just don't even play here when I'm on my own. I, I just learned that. No spot. I'll just skip this one, I think, and just uh, take a par, thanks. So he's coming from. It's pretty far away still. Look at this. But, I mean, it's got to be a good. So the basket's meters. right on the other end of the screen there, down, yeah. down there by that fence. And. It looks like it's got pretty close yeah, to it pretty close. Yeah, no, that's a good shot. Should be a simple enough layout for Joe. I mean, he'll just drop the sun there. I mean, you want to just be careful about the little roll after, you know. Just maybe just land it a touch short of the basket. Yeah, you know? yeah. Um, yeah. Just account for it. But um, coming from Manchester and from um, yeah, Longford yeah. Park, we don't have hills in Longford uh, Park. Well, so just flat uh, righty yeah. hyzers the whole way around. Things. Yeah. Oh, what a course, yeah. No, yeah. I mean, they've done a fine job there. The <laughs> teeth are nice. And, um, 
Uh, there uh, we go. Is that what you wanted? Head. Is that what you're looking for? I mean, no, no, it's always good. <laughs> no, actually, no, it taught me to throw a sidewinder very nicely, actually. Like, really, like, I just, because I don't have a forehand, and so I just started flipping. I got really good at flipping over discs by the end of it. Um, yeah. Um, so it's a bit too, just, a bit too far yeah. down there. I mean, I, I, it's easy to do. I went OB long on this in my, in my um, terrible, terrible Saturday afternoon round. Yes, um, you can see the rain on the lens here and the wind. Yeah, um, I mean, come on. I mean, when you get when the wind gets, I mean, he just doesn't. His heart doesn't look like in it anymore, man. Like, yeah. just, just rushing them a bit and just. Whereas Ben holding. Is a Terminator. Yeah, that's and it. there it is. You just you just feel it with him. You just just down in there like oh, we care in the world. Yeah, I'll nail yeah, this. nail it. So yeah. OB and then a par on yeah. the from there. Come <laughs> on now, James. Don't do something silly. That's yeah. it. There you, go. there you go. Another birdie. Yeah. It. So we've got one hole left. Yeah, I mean, if it, obviously the right is on the wall at this point, but I mean, I mean it was well deserved. I mean, it was a favourite all weekend, you know, it was going to be. Yeah, yeah. You know. Right, so this is Gulagon. The basket's right down there on the other side of the on the other side of the pond, the lake. The lake. The ocean. Oh, there's James Lewin. That's. Oh, that's just enough, I think, yeah. Yeah. So he's just at the bottom of those, yeah. just at the bottom of those trees there. No. Would Joe dare lay up? Who would do that? I don't I mean, know. Me. I mean, <laughs> I think it's like, uh, there you go. I mean, it's a trickier shot for the lefty. I mean, yeah, that's without the phase. forehand as well. I mean, that's that's basically where I land every time. I I, I just keep trying to bend a compass to that basket, and he goes, yeah, no, 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 <laughs> no, into that no. field. Uh, whereas you just got that simple, just little bang off all the space in the world, let it fade towards it, and bends down there as well, not quite as far. It just avoids a bogey stream at the bottom. Yeah. yeah. Again, another lefty, so let's see how Connor handles this. Okay. Oh dear. Thanks, sir. Sorry. <laughs> um, <laughs> Amelia just said, oh dear, there, as it, as it went down. Yeah, so, well, <laughs> I, I don't think he's handled it well. Um, I'm going to say it's probably OB right there. Um, he done. He yeah, have done very well to have made it to the other side. Um, drops in for holding. Should be a simpler forehand for him here. Oh, a little big, but I mean, normally there'd be a bunch of people sitting there. Yeah, just got smashed by that disc. But it's a bit breezy. Again, a bit drops in for Connor. I mean, it's such a signature hole of the course. I mean, it's just yeah. It's, well, we've had the we've had the live stream going there um, oh, yes. all day, so hoping to catch some amazing yeah, shots. Yeah. Uh, uh, was me. Uh, did, did you throw it? I threw a couple down. I landed it about. Two meters from the basket. I will also show that shot there alongside Michael's at the end. Just put so. that on repeat. <laughs> just yeah. on repeat. You, you, you got the control, bro. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I almost I mean, parked it on hole one of this as well today. So. I mean, surely Ben goes for this just because it's Ben and he's awesome. And... Oh, uh, get that fence post. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I'm not sure quite at the height, but still. It would have been right at the bottom of the basket. I though, think that's they? another benefit of the doubt for Ben, though. <laughs> the benefit of the doubt. <laughs> what a terrible joke. Here we go, go on, James. Do it. I'm feeling this. Yeah. There it is. Yeah. What a boy. There it is. On another birdie. He actually finished the final quite strongly. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Like, oh, just... Oh, we all know he's got it in him. Like, there he is. My fans. Waving to the waving, waving to the huge crowd. Yes. <laughs> oh, 
Yeah. Let's try to finish with Ben. You know, let's just go seating up second, second place there or something. Connor, I mean, Connor. Yeah. Connor, I don't think he's played here before. Uh, no. So it's pretty good showing really for his first time out. Yeah. Joe played lots of time. Oh, there he is. What nice. champ. I mean, Joe Bryan. I mean, he was heavy favourite and um, a deserved winner, really. I mean, it's it great to see him. Yeah, you know, yeah. So well, great, great. Well, it's good for the country to have such a good so, quality saw, player. Saw him in Manchester last year. Seems to be on a on a roll now. Yeah. I mean, you know, if if you beat Joe these days, you normally win the tournament. Um, yes. Phil Wood, by the way, with great help running this event. Yeah, so yeah, he did a Phil really good job. And the whole board, they were they were excellent. Um, as, as always, yeah, selfless work. So there he is. There he is. Uh, British champion, uh, 2022. That's great. And um, hey, I really love the trophies this year. They, yeah, uh, they were made by um, my brother Pat. Um, did an excellent job. Just spent two days sanding and eight days showering all the mess off him. But uh, yeah, I mean, they came out, came out lovely, didn't they? Yeah, that's it. Okay, so um, that is uh, yeah. British yeah. beat. <laughs> Well, that's the final, anyway, of the, uh, of the open chance. card. But there was yeah. obviously a lot more that happened, and a lot of people had a lot of fun. And uh, it was, yeah, it was an excellent event. Like, it's just such a great crowd to come, and the weather was nice, and yeah, we, I loved it. Yeah, it was so much fun. I really enjoyed being here. Yeah, thanks for coming. Yeah. Thanks for filming. Cool. Um, so that's it. Um, I hope you enjoyed this uh, coverage. Uh, we hope to do it next year a few more times. Um, so stick around for that. Oh, and come down and watch a final throws or something. Oh yeah, come down for final throws. I'm definitely coming down yes. at least once next definitely. year for final definitely. throws. Yeah. Um, and uh, yeah, so subscribe to the uh, Neutrino Disc Golf to see uh, more coverage uh, in the future and also all of the other other videos. Um, and yeah, yeah, I think that's, that's it. it. Yeah, cool. let's go beer. Let's go and have a beer. Um, and we will leave you with. Sharky's chain out oh. on hole 18. You lucky people, it is gorgeous. And my amazing layout. <laughs> cool. I Cheers. like a layout. <laughs> nice one, man. I think it's good.